Hello and welcome to the Finnish countryside. Those who have been here longer know what an amazing winter we have had this year. So much snow. So much cold. A real winter, like in a picture book. We have had some very cold waves during this winter and if you want to see how we were doing with minus 30 degrees celsius then look at that video in the corner. In this video I'm gonna show you not only the beauty of this northern winter but also tell you about things which you maybe don't realize before you live somewhere where the winter is like this. This kind of winter might sound hard when there's so much time going on things like keeping the house warm and shoveling the snow, but it's just so unbelievably beautiful that those are things what you like to do. And like we often ask, what else would you be doing instead of that? Something very important or rather something maybe not that important. Everybody wants to have a faster world with less time going on those basic things, but what are they then doing with their time set? Of course, there are many other things as well to consider when it's cold and snowy. At first, you obviously have to clear the yard of the snow. And what's totally different than in the summer, if you want to drive with the car. Depending on how cold it is, you have to put the engine heating on 30 to 60 minutes before you want to leave somewhere. Then you of course have to clean up the car of the snow because our car is standing outside. Now we also have a battery charger in the car so that the heating system always has electricity so that's also something you shouldn't forget, plug in and take it out again before driving. Driving on the snowy roads is mostly just very very nice because usually there is not much traffic.
but the roads are not always nice and clean. Sometimes they are icy like an ice rink. Sometimes there is so much wet snow that it feels like you were driving on a wet sponge with the car sliding the whole time and you're just trying to keep it on the road. Sometimes there's just a lot of snow, but it's not that bad because it's not slippery. The only difficult parts are when there's first a bend and after that a hill because you need a lot of speed for the hill but you can't drive full gas into a bend. So yes, you definitely have to plan more time for everything in the winter and many basic things like heating or just dressing up are a lot more difficult but like I said, it's at the same time so magical that who cares? I don't. There are also so many funny things what you can do only in the winter, like snowboard. Ice skating. Ice fishing, ice swimming. Parking around. Sledding with the huskies. Building snow castles or whatsoever. Things which require snow and cold to work. Things which you are doing in the winter without thinking much about how you are not able to do those things much longer like you might be thinking in the summer. There are also so beautiful things in the winter which you see only at this time of the year, like the stars and the darkness.
I think I haven't always been this kind of person who really appreciates those things which are available at the moment. A person who is not always missing something which you don't have. But life is just so much easier and nicer when you don't think that way. When you can be thankful for those things which you have. Or just for the snow, for the sun, for whatsoever. So, like I said, this winter was a blast. We were expecting a colder and snowier winter than what we had in Turku. But this one was, was much more than we could ever wish for. So many stunning sunrises and sunsets. So much beauty during day and night. So thank you, Winter. This one will stay in our hearts forever, not just as our first countryside winter, but also as one of the best winters we have ever experienced. So, I hope you liked this video. And if you hate winter, then don't worry, because this was most probably the very last uh, winter video of this season. Uh, because next time we see, see each other, it's already middle of March. And then it should start looking maybe a bit more like spring than winter. But um, next week the weather forecast shows once again minus 10 degrees Celsius. So. <laughs> Let's see um, how all this snow <laughs> starts to melt. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, I wish everyone a nice weekend. And if you want to see more daily life, then Instagram is the place for that one. And I hope to see you in the next time again. And until then. Bye-bye.